Nearly three dozen people are arrested for dealing PCP and other drugs for the shocking twist. They're charged with using an eight-year-old boy as a lookout. New York One's Tatiana Anderson has the latest from East Harlem tonight. Tatiana? And, Lewis, the police commissioner and the Manhattan district attorney both said today that that eight-year-old boy was a victim in all of this. It's really hard to believe the scope of operation that we're talking about. Police say that it took them 15 months to gather enough evidence to bust this drug ring. They were operating here in East Harlem, and police say they were making a million dollars a year by selling PCP, cocaine, and heroin, and that two brothers were behind this drug network. They're Lamont Moultrie, 41 and Bernard Moultrie, 39. They were part of that 35-member career that was taken down today, all of them facing charges ranging from conspiracy to criminal sales of a controlled substance. The clients in all of this, police say, ranged from housewives to out-of-towners, and it was an empire run just like a legitimate business. Even as this neighborhood has improved over the years, drug sales over the last 15 months began to attract addicts from other boroughs, Long Island and New Jersey, and as far away as Vermont. In other words, they made Millbrink Frawley houses a drug destination. It was pretty structured. I will say that. There were, there were posts. Um, you knew where you had to be. You knew what your, your hours were going to be. Police say that it was complaints from people who lived here that led to the investigation and to this bust. And some of those people that I talked to today say that if more people spoke up, the streets of this city would be much safer. People got to stop being in fear. We living in a community of fear. Everybody come out of their apartments. Oh, it ain't my business. I come and go. If you live here, it's your business. Because when your baby gets shot or you get shot, you're going to be complaining. And as for that eight-year-old boy who was a lookout, other people told me that perhaps he was just doing what he had to do to help feed his family and that that situation really is a reflection of the economic times we're facing. Either way, police have taken him into custody. He's with Child Protective Services. In East Harlem, I'm Tatiana Anderson. Lewis, back to you. Thanks, Tatiana.